Hello makeup freaks, welcome back to my channel. I am doing my second look of Halloween theme for this month of October. Let's jump in. It's not a game. It's a I am going to start off by showing you each product that I am going to be using today. We're gonna to start off with our e.l.f. Poreless Putty primer and then we're going to come in with our nyx first base primer mist foundation mix with our oil our foundation today is from pharmacy formula or physician formula sorry and hydro touch from nyx for concealer we will be using the elf 16 hour combo concealer and this one is in light peach. For foundation powder, we are using the Fit Me by Maybelline, and this is shade 130, and this is a buff beige. Then we're coming in with our Fenty Beauty setting powder, and this is in butter. For highlighter today, we are using a Sapphire, a Sapphire Botanicals, and this is the Daisy and Pearl. And to set it all together, we're going to be using the CoverGirl Active Setting Spray. For eyeshadows today, we are going to be using two palettes. We are going to be using the Renaissance Palette from Anastasia and the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani Palette. For application brushes, we are going to use foundation and concealer. We are using the My Makeup Brush Set and this is a flat brush. We're gonna be using three of Wet n Wild's brushes. We're going to be using a BH Cosmetic 126. It's a tapered out brush. A BH Cosmetic number two, and this is a flat, a flat Kabuki brush. Second to last, we're using the ELF Cosmetic Small Kabuki brush. The last one we are using is an Anastasia Dual brush. For lashes today, we are going to be using the Lux Lashes. For adhesive, we're using the House of Lashes. Eyeliner, we are going to be using the Maybelline Master Graphic Eyeliner. Mascara, we are going to be using the L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. For eyeliner today, we are going to be using the Sigma Longwear Eyeliner Pencil. Lip liner, we are going to be using a red lip liner, and this is Savage Red. For lipsticks, we are using two. We are using uh, the Safari from Anastasia, and this one is Midnight from Anastasia as well. As you can tell, I'm not wearing nails this time because I'm not doing the mistake. It was really hard last time. So we're gonna apply them in the end. We are going to be using the SM nails and these ones you can find on amazon do note these are very very long so that's why i'm using it in the end the look i am going for today everyone knows i'm obsessed with medieval time witches so that is the look we're doing i have went ahead already and i did my little moon crescent on a piece of tape i am going to cut it out and after i prime i'm going to place it on my cabeza like this and then do my foundation This is where I'm going to place my moon on my frente. Now we come in with our foundation and apply our foundation.
now that I have put my foundation on and I look as white as the wall, let's move on to the next step. We're going to come in and just color in our forehead. And we're going to, for this step, we're gonna use our Renaissance palette from Anastasia. And we are going to start off with the shade Red Orchard. ahead and switch our color and our brush we're going to be using the wet and wild big fluffy brush we're going to go into our veteran red Now that we have put our under eye color and our eyelashes, we're going to come in and slightly use the serious color on our lid. BH tapered brush we are going to come in on Sirius
All right, guys, we're to the steps. Let's take off the moon. Okay, this hairdo and this robe was not really working out, so let's go ahead and change. That's more like it. notice I put my nails off nope on off camera one little tip if you get these type of nails and you use the little sticky thing that goes with it make sure you, you clean your nails with alcohol because then it won't stick so then you're forced to use the glue if you noticed uh, everything that I use is things that I have already lying around my house I didn't buy anything new um, I'm trying to do inexpensive makeup looks i know that right now it's kind of hard to go out and go buy costumes or makeup that is halloween makeup uh, i'm also going to link my last video from last week up above as reference to things you can use at home like the alufa that i used to create the gills if you like this video go ahead and give it a like leave your comments down below for me if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any new no new upcoming videos and i will see you guys next wednesday at 2 p.m bye